Hi, this is Mayor Maureen Miller Brosnan. You know, every day it seems like things are changing in the city, and we realize it can be hard to keep up. So we want to make it as easy as possible for residents to know the status of their favorite parks and rec program or library program or what's happening at the senior center or any of the countless ways that we serve our residents. That's why today we're releasing What's Open in Livonia. It's an easy to read dashboard that's available on the city's website. It shows what programs and services are available now as well as what city buildings are open and it can be updated as things change. On the dashboard you can see what's open in green. Right now those are largely outside pools and programs put on by the Parks and Recs Department, election services at the clerk's office, and emergency services. What's closed is identified in red. Currently, that includes Livonia City Hall, the Rec Center, our Senior Center, and 16th District Court services. Services that are operating a little different right now because of the pandemic are shown in yellow. For many city services, this yellow category means limited access or by appointment only as we encourage residents to conduct city business online, by phone, by using the big red mailbox at City Hall, or by setting an appointment. As you can see on the dashboard, City Hall remains closed. We're preparing to open on July 20th. Our building is old, so it's taken a little while to make all the changes that are necessary to keep our employees, residents, and visitors safe. Also, waiting until July 20th keeps us in line with the current expiration of Michigan's state of emergency on July 15th. When the building does reopen, you're gonna see a lot of changes. First, we're requiring that visitors wear masks. We'll also have marked social distancing spots, and we've set up plexiglass shields to keep city employees and visitors safe. To ensure that everyone is following those guidelines, we're gonna be limiting entry to City Hall to the south entrance of the building, that's near the fountain, and restricting visitors' access to the first floor. We're asking that you first try to access city services remotely or call for an appointment. Our red, yellow, green, what's open in Livonia dashboard is going to be updated regularly to keep you notified about the dynamic and unprecedented challenge of COVID-19. You know, we're not out of the woods yet, so the dashboard will be there should we need to shut down again. But we can all do our part to avoid that. Keep wearing your mask, maintain those social distances, limit the time outside your home interacting with others and keep washing your hands. Together, we're gonna to continue to do our best to keep everyone safe and provide the high quality services that you expect. We hope that you'll continue to do your part as well. Stay strong, Livonia.